This is Net Zero Chem's hydrogen apparatus, ready for a run. This is the biggest system of its kind in the world, as far as we know. Um, and I'll tell you a little bit more detail about it. We're making hydrogen using this aluminium waste, machining waste, very low value scrap as a, as a fuel source. And we turn it into this aluminium hydroxide which is a valuable strategic raw material. And along the way, <laughs> we're making lots and lots of hydrogen. The system's ready to run. The aluminium is in the reaction chamber, the stereo is running, the fans, and all the other bits. Not to worry what they are. I'll just put the catalyst pump on. And we'll wait a moment for the catalyst to reach the system. Right, the catalyst bump has been running for about 30 seconds now and the reaction is going to start. Normally at the beginning of, of a, a run, we dump the hydrogen to the outside air because it's contaminated with oxygen from the air all around us. And uh, so I'm going to close the dump valve now and you'll see the hydrogen start to come up through the system. This won't take very long, it's producing a lot of hydrogen. And if you look over on the right, there, let me zoom in. There, you can see the bubbles coming up. And round here, there's a high pressure system, which will probably start running in a moment, uh, which will be hydrogen at higher pressure. Yes, there it goes. In this run, we're gonna be making a round about, a small amount of hydrogen, round about 1,000 liters. There. Now, to get back to the system overall, um, you have on the right hand side the reactor, on, in the centre is the control system and the bubblers and that other cylinder with the sandy coloured material in it, a part of the hydrogen purification system. But we do know it does produce very pure hydrogen. Many thanks for watching. You can see now there's a lot of hydrogen being produced there. I'm going to change now we the shop round and show you the other bubbler, the high pressure bubbler, and you can see that one there. That's hydrogen at around about 5 psi there. Not spectacularly high pressure, but it's good to run a generator, which from time to time we do. If you um, have trouble getting your head around some of this, uh, there are lots of facts and figures involved. It's a very simple illustration. A bucket full of aluminium scrap like that on the left makes a bucket full of alum valuable aluminium hydroxide like the one on the right, but it also makes a thousand bucketfuls of hydrogen. That's a lot of gas.